We are less than a week away now from the start of school. Tonight, parents and students voicing their opinions on school mask mandates at the LPS board meeting. Channel 8's Yosef Nasser has all the details in our top story tonight. One by one, Lincoln residents of all ages spoke to the Lincoln Board of Education, asking them to reconsider their stance on masks in schools. I'm going to ask you nicely, stop putting my kids in masks. Stop putting everybody else's kids in masks. We know now that they don't do anything. If you put a mask on all my friends, how am I supposed to know if they're mad, sad, or angry? If you put a mask on our teachers, how am I supposed to read their faces? It is up to the parents to decide if their kids are at risk and whether to have them wear masks. Reverse the mask mandate and reinstate optional mask wearing. Last week, Lincoln Public Schools announced that students in pre-kindergarten to sixth grade will be required to wear masks in schools. While many in attendance at the board meeting were opposed to the policy, some parents asked for mask mandates for students of all grade levels. It's just not fair to the kids who have to be there in prison to not have the protection of masks. Um, so I hope that you will all follow the CDC guidance and make, it masks, um, make masks universally required for elementary, middle, and high school. Per the policy, masks are optional for vaccinated students in the 7th through 12th grade and are strongly recommended for unvaccinated students. LPS Superintendent Dr. Steve Joel explained the board's decision was made in conjunction with the Lincoln-Lancaster County Health Department. He indicated that it's unlikely that the mask policy will change before school starts next week. We're, we're hearing that numbers are not going in the right direction with regard to the Delta variant, and, um, and we're getting ready to open up our schools on Monday. So, you know, there's, there's not a whole window here or a lot of time to, uh, to give consideration to it. Reporting in Lincoln, Yosef Nasser with Nebraska's trusted news source.